What's up guys, your boy DJ Stash, here again on the review, and today's episode I'm reviewing two new variations from Buffalo Wild Wings. This is going to be the beer battered chicken sandwiches. I, like, I don't know what it is guys, it's been going on this like past, uh, in the month of August, like this the chicken sandwich craze has been just booming, fucking, like Popeye's the biggest for some reason, like been sold out, He's like all just the regular chicken sandwiches. Now Buffalo Wild Wings got into the mix, uh, Cracker Barrel's gone to the mix. I still gotta get into that. They have apparently like a BLT chicken sandwich. So I gotta get to that one at some point. Uh, and then also, I'll just look up today as we're recording, it's like Jack in the Box has gotten to the mix too. It's called like their big chicken sandwich or something. It's like you can get a double, triple, or quad chicken sandwich. And then they also got some of more of their uh, curly fries things. I forgot what they call it. But they've, they've done different varieties of those little uh, fried gimmicks. That's a little, little cartons. I can't remember off tan right now, but I'm double review that. And I'll probably just get like a regular double stick of sandwich because I'm not fucking getting a quad. And then, uh, I think that's about it because Chick fil A's always had their chicken sandwiches. But that's the big thing on like Instagram and shit right now. It's like uh, pie pies versus fucking Chick fil A. <laughs> it's pretty funny to watch. But yeah, but now Buffalo Wild Wings got into the game. Uh, it's right up a chew boom. It says Buffalo Wild Wings adds hand breaded chicken to the menu with their introduction of three new menu items. Uh, <clears throat> offerings is all beer battered uh, with the uh, Lang uh, Languatas, this IPA. I've had it before, it's all right. Like I've, if y'all follow my channel before, I'm, uh, for a while, I've not really a big fan of IPAs, so, but we'll try it out, it isn't chicken. Uh, but the, <clears throat> the kind of sandwiches they have is the uh, Southern Chicken Sandwich the natural hot chicken sandwich and they got it in tenders. I didn't get the tenders, so I just got the sandwiches. So if you want the tenders, you know, let me know in the comments below. I'll try to do it for y'all. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna do one at a time. I'm gonna do the regular one first. All right, this is the, uh, the Southern chicken sandwich. It features a uh, beer battered chicken breast topped with Swiss cheese, bacon, uh, aloe. I've had that before, but as always, fucking can't pronounce that. Uh, Napa slaw, which that was new to me as well. When I read that, I was like, Napa slaw. Uh, and pickles, all sandwiched in uh, between a chala bun. So, all right, let's try it out. Right. So, got the fries. This is pretty side, why not? All right, so, it looks pretty tasty, man. When was the last time I've been to Buffalo Wild Wings? It was like when I tried that other burger sandwich. Like some cheese sandwich, I can't remember. Or sandwich burger, whatever. I would try it out. The Southern Chicken Sandwich. Also, this one, you can get it in a grill as well. But I just thought I'd try it fried. Fuck it. I would try it out. Mmm. That's pretty good. I still think about the map and that was slow. So like coastal that I usually get. So the more of these kind of bits. Kinda of gives me kind of that KFC vibe with the chicken. I don't know if it's like, I was gonna put eggs to the sandwich, chicken sandwiches. It's pretty far. I like it a lot. Let me get a, I'm gonna taste the national one before I do a review of this one. All right. Now the Nashville <clears throat> hot chicken sandwich, it features, uh, you know, the beer pattern, chicken, chicken breasts, uh, where it's smothered in the uh, Nashville hot sauce. And it's paired with the uh, Napa slaw. Uh, but it also has uh, Fresno chili peppers, uh, ranch dressing, and pickles all on the uh, chalet bun. Because originally I was going to only get one of them because I figured the Nashville, I was originally going to just get the Nashville. Because I figured the Nashville and the Southern was kind of be the same, just like it just had the Nashville sauce on it. But as you said, it had like the peppers and uh, all the sauce on it. So, you know, ranch dressing. So, had more, a couple extra ingredients. So, I was like, all right, let's get both. Fuck it. All right, sound what's up. That looks. Pretty coated. Oh, and I'll say also, uh, Church of Chicken has gotten to the mix because I reviewed that one as well. It's like all these places are just like coming up with like spicy variations. 
Because I looked at it, I was like, oh, you can tell the difference from the original and the Nashville, this Nashville hot sauce. Yeah, it looks pretty damn good. All right, we'll try it out. The Nashville hot chicken sandwich. Cheers. Mm. It's more tangier than the uh, Jersey chicken sauce. The flaming hot sauce that I have. I don't know if it's cool, but this is more sturdier. I have the spice, so you see the pepper right here. Let's come up with the pepper. Mm. Yeah, everything's on par with this one. I should follow my channel. <clears throat> I don't like really heat with spice. I don't think I've ever had this kind of pepper before. It's Fresno chili pepper. But it's, it's pretty on point. I like it a lot. Mix this well with the uh, natural hot sauce. Also with the natural hot sauce, you can uh, currently add it to your wings, which I got one wings as well, but I'm not gonna review that because it's just regular wings. It's because uh, it's Thursday and I'm currently recording, the, currently recording this. So uh, I got like, it's like the, they got a deal for their bonus wings right now. And also for like uh, Thursday to Monday right now for the Labor Day weekend, <clears throat> you get like pretty good deals for game day. Like it's like five dollar pitchers right now for like uh, the current, you know, your mainstream light beers like the Bud Light, Coors Light, Miller Light. I got like a pitcher of Bud Light, so I got that before doing the <laughs> doing the review of these. So pretty, pretty, pretty lit. Mm. Yeah, I'm uh, reviewing this. I think it was a five out of five. And the uh, regular one, I think it was a four out of five. If uh, you had to choose one or the other, definitely go with the natural hot sauce. Or you'd like a little bit a more kick and flavor, this is the way to go. All right, guys. This is the New York Buffalo Wild Wings Chicken Beer Batter Sandwiches. If you enjoyed this review, please give us a like, share, and subscribe. Be sure to check out all my social media down in the description down below. Give me a follow. And... Be sure to hit that notification bell to stay tuned to all my future videos. Until next time, guys, it's your boy, DJ Stash, saying off saying peace.